Hi, this is Nick Carraza of Creative 111, and I'm here to talk to you today about some new features in Apple's compressor, a great companion to Final Cut Pro for exporting. And one of the new features is the ability to basically take all of your HD or UHD clips and turn them into vertical or square for different social media platforms. <laughs> So I'm here in Compressor and currently have five clips that I would like to convert to the square format. The first thing I'm going to do is head over to my settings tab on the left and under the video sharing services, just grab a QuickTime 4K setting and drag it onto the first clip here. With the actual setting selected, I'm going to go to my inspector that's here on the right and click this button to open it if it's closed and under the video tab, where it says frame size, I'm going to choose a square setting to be up to 1080 by 1080. Now in my video preview area, we don't get any feedback for how that's going to look in the square aspect ratio. So if I head down in the video tab even further to the cropping and padding, we can go to cropping and set this to a one by one ratio. In compressor, there are two sides to the screen actually divided by this line here. So on the right hand side, we're getting a preview of what this cropping is going to do. But on the left, we don't quite see that until I drag the center line all the way to left. And now we can see that square cropping. Now, in order to move this box, in case we had to change the framing of the shot, we could head to the cropping setting again and just choose custom. It's going to keep that square setting. But now we're able to move that cropping box and after playback decide that I want to zoom in here on this fish. The great thing is we can actually now take this setting. I'm going to press command C and then paste it by pressing command V onto the next clip. But here on the next clip with that setting selected under the custom setting, I'll just play back the clip to make sure that the square format does encapsulate the main person here. In fact, I'll move it maybe a little bit over to the right to get the majority of the action. I want to repeat that again for these other clips. So I'll select this first one, shift click this last one, command V because I have that default setting. And then by playing back each of these clips with those cropping settings, if needed, I can make adjustments to what I'd like to have in the shot. Now that this is all set up, the location to where each of these are going to be exported is the desktop. So I'm going to click on the start batch button and we can see that this is going to actually start to export. So I've taken those UHD clips and created square video formats for them for social media. And that's how easy it is to do with the latest version of Compressor. I'm Nick Haraz, and for more tips and tricks like this, subscribe to Creative 111.